10 o'clock news. A record-breaking $112 billion city budget announced by the mayor and city council speaker today, if approved the enormous spending plan, backtracks most of Eric Adams' proposed cuts. Fox 8 Jessica Formosa shows us which programs are being saved. The plane has landed, which only means one thing, a deal has been reached. Mayor Eric Adams and City Council Speaker Adrian Adams all smiled this morning after a record-breaking $112.4 billion budget deal, the largest spending plan in the city's history. We got into plane throughout all the turbulence. Many of you who are on board with us thought the turbulence mean the plane was going to sink. No. Adams and Adams United is here to say we have a deal. The proposed budget reversing many of the mayor's cuts, including cuts to the arts, libraries, and early childhood programs. Last year, the mayor said all city agencies would have to slash their budgets due to the migrant crisis, saying the books won't balance. But after a contentious back and forth between the mayor and speaker, funding has been restored. The budget reimagined early childhood education through a $100 million, 10-point strategic plan, and it helps identify seats for families. In addition, $20 million will pay for additional spots for 3K. No longer can we simply budget for seats and let thousands sit empty when families remain on wait lists or are placed in areas that cause them to disregard the system altogether. The city is also investing $53 million in cultural institutions and $58 million in funding to keep the doors to all libraries open. Our libraries are among our city's most precious resources. $2 billion will go to NYCHA over the next two years for capital projects to build more housing. The budget plan will go before the council for a vote on Sunday. In the newsroom, I'm Jessica Formoso, Fox 5 News. All right, let's get a check of the forecast now.